dumpster cats cooking. <laughs> Last night I did the chicken and the stuffing and that. And today I figured I would reheat the leftover chicken. Plus I have. Aw, hubby. Thank you, baby. Plus I have my mild sauce from Colucci's Pizza. Um, that hubby brought home. Sorry. So I am getting the oil. Well, it's margarine. But pretty much the oil in the pan. So that I can uh, fry up my chicken. And then I'm going to put it on a bed of cheap ass salad mix that I got from Aldi's and I'm gonna have me a chicken salad from the leftover chicken from last night dumpster hubby and I went and spent forty dollars well it was uh, thirty three ninety four we had I had put forty dollars for uh, groceries aside, and I ended up spending thirty-three. <laughs> um, I'm gonna add a little bit more salt before, so that it cooks in with the flavor, and then I don't have to add it on afterwards. I'm trying to watch my salt intake um, now. Garlic powder, on the other hand, that's powder. That, mm, I love me some garlic powder, and to throw my spices on the floor, but I had, uh, got some, you know, like, necessities, and some other non-necessities, but necessities, because, you know, we have nothing in this house. Literally, my spice cabinet. Ooh, pepper. And I think my uh, Italian seasoning is what fell out. And I'll throw my butter back in there. I don't want... Um, because I had put the uh, chicken in the um, same bowl as my stuffing, leftover stuffing last night, the stuffing absorbed whatever juice the chicken had left. So that's why I'm using the margarine to add some juice back into the chicken. There's nothing worse than dry chicken breast. And I'm more of a white meat, so I prefer the breast. So I try to do anything that I can to get it to where it's not as dry. But while that's sauteing my screen, um, let me click my flashback on. So we went to Aldi's, we got some cola. I broke down, bought four cans of green beans. Two cans of sweet corn when Dumpster Coons here. He's not a big fan of green beans, so the corn's for when he's here. Obviously, same with the spaghetti and meatballs and the beef raviolis. Um, I got another loaf of bread. Two boxes of the scallop potatoes. That one down, and two bo two more boxes of the chicken stuffing mix. I'm trying to make my bread not fall. I had one box left from when we bought when I went over to um I don't even remember where I bought it from. Oh, sorry to say it was Walmart. So they were 34 cents. Uh, same with the ones from. Aldi's, they're 34 cents, so I bought four of those. I still had those two. We got another thing of sugar. 
Um, I got two more things of butter. This is our uh, two more things of butter. This is our supply of food for when Joey's here this weekend. Tomorrow uh, or Wednesday, I'm cooking up the um, ground beef, making a meatloaf with mashed potatoes and green beans. I have a two pack of ch chicken breast back there. I got. A thing of eggs that's back there, be a twelve, a dozen of eggs. That was nope, and <laughs> that was the salad mix. And then I also got the buttermilk complete pancake mix because during the week I can make up pancakes one night and eggs. I got my brown sugar for my. Any of my sauces, anything I use, spaghetti sauce or my meatloaf in that, I, um, I got the syrup also. That's what I was going to show you. Nope, I got those from Family Dollar. Um, any of the sauces in that, I have to add the brown sugar to so that it um, helps with the uh, acid. Sorry, I'm sitting here trying to flip these, and so, that was flipped. Alright, kittens, I'm going to get my salad ready before I add the mild sauce into it, I will record again. I'll be right back with ya my salad nothing fancy just the lettuce mix my chicken is still cooking nicely I want to give it a little you know a little color to it that's why I'm yeah it's different when you bake it you know it's meant to be one color, but when you fry it or bake it without the um, tin foil over it, because I had put it in a uh, cookie or my glass cake pan, and um, added a little bit of oil, regular oil, um, into it. I also got. Joe, a box of are they back there? Where is his cereal? I got him a family size box of there they are <laughs> frosted flakes. I know I did. I just put them back there. That's why I couldn't find them. All right, let this simmer for a couple more minutes, and then I'm going to add the mild sauce. I have my playlist playing. On the left is Auntie Mama's Kitchen. I'm trying to get her up to her hours. Last I knew, she was under 200. And then on the right side, it was romantic, but it just switched. Who's playing now? Oh, I should have known. It said Texas, of course. It's Candle King himself, Ray, Everyday Diver. So, let me tend to this. Hang on, kittens. Oh, that AC was also given to us by Jackie. Before I forget, because that was left in the car the other day. So, that one next year will be the one in the bedroom. This one, will, you know, we'll keep it. We'll use it unless it, I notice a it costs my electric bill too much then I won't use it and if we have to we'll put that one up in there next year but I forgot about it when I had organized my kitchen and put all my stuff or er, kitchen hmm, yeah that's a small kitchen when I organized my closet and I put all my stuff in there I had a uh, 
noticed it. I hear it sizzling. Alright, before, it's going to be hard to try to pour that one-handed, so let me put it on there and I'll show you. I had turned it down right before. I should have turned it down like a minute before, but it didn't sizzle too, too bad. No. I let that sit there. Marinate just for a little bit. And then I will put it on my salad. I was going to get shredded lettuce today, but I mean, <laughs> oh my god, I just... If you don't know by now that I don't speak properly, <laughs> you're on the wrong channel. I cannot say the right words to save my life. I am so lucky I am not someone that has to speak properly to, you know, like to help people in that because I would be so screwed and so would they. Alright. <laughs> Let me put the splash guard back on it because I know it's splattering. Turn it off. Alright, now that part I'm really not going to be able to do while I'm camming. Camming. I'll be right back with you kittens. I drizzled a little bit more of the mild sauce on it from my other container. Before I add the ranch. Let me turn my light back on in here. Before I add the ranch. Let's see. There we go. That is amazing. Mmm. Mm -hmm. I might just add a little bit for dipping and not. Mm. I'm not one for trying to eat in front of people, and that it really has never been a strong suit for me. You know, having dentures when I was in my 30s. But, I know it's a hot topic right now. I believe it's called mukbang. My necklace is reflecting. That is crazy. Mm. That was one of the dumpster scores. It's very pretty. That is amazing. Mmm. The butter made it so that the chicken was not dry. Mmm. That is amazing. Alright, kittens. <laughs> I hope you like this lunchtime. Well, actually, this will be my own. Uh, because of, you know, the IBS, I have to eat hours before I go out and do anything. Just so that there's no issues. So this is my dinner. Um, I'll make hubby. Um, I have the uh, stuffing and all cooking up, cook him up something, uh, unless he gets chicken again at work tonight, but that is my dinner, and I'm going to go enjoy that here in a second. If you kittens liked watching me prepare, and that was all on, there was, there's no recipe, I don't, I do everything off the 
cuff. I don't follow recipes. I just, oh, that you know, that sounds good. Let me try that. I did that with the onion soup. You know that Lipton's onion soup that you buy? I used that and threw it in a bag, put my chicken in it, added, you know, my other seasonings, parsley, Italian, paprika, salt, pepper, garlic powder, minced onions. Um, and I had a uh, Oh, that's actually a better camp angle view, too. I, um, I marinated it for, like, six hours. It was one of the best-tasting chicken that I've made. And I put it in my um, glass cake pan, added a little bit of oil, mm -mm, enough to coat the bottom to make it so that, you know, it was, but not, like, not just enough to coat the bottom, um, and then covered it in tin foil. Oh, that light just almost got me in the eye. And covered it. In... No, it's not that either. Where is that coming from? That's gonna annoy me. <laughs> but I baked it. You know, um, 20 minutes, flipped it, 20 minutes, flipped it, and it was amazing. Don't be afraid to try different things. I swear, somebody is... I'm not moving. It's got to be reflecting off of something in the... Because I don't have nothing else on. I don't know. Thanks for watching, kittens. If you like this video, let me know. Click that like button down below. And if you're out on new to the channel and you love all this craziness, dumpster diving. Blessing box. I'll be going Wednesday. So, I may not wait, make you wait until Monday. I'll probably throw it up before then, just because of how long it's been since we've had a blessing box. I think it's my flash. It was the flash. <laughs> I should have known. <laughs> I'm a dumbass. <laughs> but if you do like all this stupid silliness, go ahead and consider subscribing and becoming one of my newest... One of my newest dumpster kittens. I love you kittens. I hope you have an amazing breakfast, lunch, dinner, whatever you're having. I hope you're having a great one. Love you kittens, and I will catch you in the next video.